how does Atman Tech and your team manage uh, a roadmap? It's difficult. You're getting push and pull from your customers. You also see the future and where this product can go and the solution can take its existing customers as well as the market. How do you manage those expectations internally and externally? It's hard, um, but we have a, a simple philosophy, which is, you know, we are customer driven. We must, must help and support our customers and we must focus on what our customers need. Um, and the word there is need. So that's my first step is to understand what they're trying to achieve, what their business problem is, because, you know, I, I may have a different way to solve their problem. And, I, and often we do. Um, but so the first step is what does the customer need not want so they're, they're wanting a new feature or a new solution a new thing done in our product but they need something and it's usually they need data or they need processing of some so a classic example years ago was that we had a customer who wanted to get their portal system that they were using and they kept asking for sql data and sql data i sort of said well why do you want the sql data and then they they finally told me it's for this portal system i said great does the portal system support apis and they said yes it does and i said does it support JSON APIs? And they said, yes, it does. I said, well, why don't you just use our JSON APIs and grab the data out of the, the system directly and just, you know, pull that into the, you know, into the, um, into your portal system. And they went, wow. And so we needed to add a few extra APIs that we didn't have at the time, but this was a while ago. So we didn't, you know, we just had to add a few extra APIs. So they asked for the data to be pushed and exported and dumped into databases, huge effort and really hard to scale. And then in the end, they, what they actually needed was they just needed access to the data using APIs. Solve their problem and you know, they're still using that today and it, it helps them scale their operations. And, and that's a really, really important thing is giving customers what they need. And, and it's about prioritization. So, so that our company and our, our customers have ideas which may not be viable or feasible at a certain time. And our staff have ideas which, which are really, you know, all, all, all ideas are good. And so what we do is we kind of throw them into our, uh, our JIRA, our, um, a trouble ticketing system or a support development project management system, Jira, it's excellent. And we use that and we put them all in there and then we kind of wait till people ask for them. So we don't just have an idea, Opmantic, we, we have ideas to put in the products, but I don't just go and just develop them all. I kind of wait till we get uh, a correlation with our customers. So once our customers start asking for things around that capability, something similar to those features that we're thinking of, and then we align our ideas synergize like streamline the customer's need with what we're thinking of and then we go ahead and develop some new capability an example of that is nmis 9 and what we did in nmis 9 customers were asking for these multi-server capabilities that we couldn't deliver with, with a file system database it just couldn't be done so what do we have to do but to solve that problem and we solved a whole lot of problems by doing that so we didn't just give them you know we didn't just solve the single feature by copying the data they wanted to the thing so they could get their top end on the master we solved it for all data being available on the master and that's an, an, another example but net result is we're customer driven customer focused we always do things our customers uh, uh, you know, are needing, um, and then we prioritize our own ideas and our own development. Um, and, and, and so we have the ideas, you know, ideation is really, really important, but innovation is executing those ideas. So we, we sort of delay the innovation until it lines up with our customers needs and then we innovate and, and that's what we do.